So I bought this VW uh, 67 uh, bug sunroof. Gorgeous. Bought it off oldbugs.com. Great site. And uh, But the deal with this car was, I mean, it's clearly got a built motor. It's got dual 44 Webers. F feels really strong. But the owner of the car, I bought it from the wife of a guy who had some serious medical issues. And there, so there was no documentation on the car at all. Like, we don't know, you know, is it a 1600? Is it a 2-liter? Is it a 1835? Uh, unknown. And um, so I really want to know what the displacement was, both for me and when I eventually sell the car. So, like, okay, pull the motor apart just to measure stuff. So... Um, I Googled on the Samba and a guy was talking like, oh, well, if you if it's got Mahl pistons or Mali, whatever you want to call the German brand, um, they have a marking on them that of the size. And so I bought one of these little uh, stick down a hole endoscopes on Amazon and it Wi-Fi. It's got its own little built in Wi-Fi thing and you can hook it into your iPhone or iPad. So I pulled out one spark plug. Um, Stuck this thing in the hole, and in five minutes, I find the marking. So let me see if I can find it again. Uh, I just can't believe how easy this was. Uh, okay. There it is. There it is right there. 93.93. Um, so that's probably the diameter of the piston. There's a little clearance, so it's probably 94 millimeter cylinders. So I'm gonna measure the stroke. I, I bought a skinny, a really skinny stainless steel scale. I'm gonna stick in through the spark plug hole. And even though the spark plug is angled, it looks like uh, the diameter of that is, is gonna be big enough with a skinny enough scale, you'll be able to put it in straight. And then I'll just rotate the engine and just measure the stroke externally. And then I'll know what the displacement of this motor is without taking it apart, which is just awesome. So there. I hope this helps somebody else.